Hmm. I need a boat. I should go see the shipbuilder. It's a fine ship, Telemenes. Alexios! She is that. Ready to ride the waves for the right captain and the right price. What will it take for you to part with her? <laughs> Couldn't let her go for less than 100,000. 100,000? Who has that much? Someone who's serious about buying a ship. You think craftsmanship like this is given away? What if I told you I had obsidian to trade? I tell you I still need 100,000 drachmi. Besides, even if I took your obsidian, a ship this size needs an army to sail it. This is Kefalonia. I could always find someone down on their luck and willing to work for next to nothing to get off this island. The seas are treacherous now. Well, more than usual. It would be suicide. You're not being very helpful, Telemenes. Not sure if this helps. But rumor has it the Cyclops is coming for you and Marcos. Rumors mean nothing. Don't believe everything you hear. Rumor also has it his ship is docked in Kleptus Bay. His ship, you say? I'll have to pay Kleptus Bay a visit. Be careful. That one-eyed brute has a nasty temper. So I can take his ship and deal with the Cyclops at the same time. Two birds, one stone.
Cyclops. Time to have a little chat. I should be careful. High security here. This used to be a nice village, but now it's just a nest of anarchy and crime. Huh? Did I see something? What? I think I saw something. Yeah! <laughs> 
God, that's my witness. I swear! Which one? What difference does it make? <laughs> all of them! I swear! All of them! I have never heard so much fucking God talk from one man in all my days! <gasps> Let him go. No one on this island is allowed to say that word! Did he say Cyclops? <laughs> Did it hurt your feelings? Don't like it when people call me that! Um, oh, I didn't. I don't know. But you're so fat. I mean, big, strong. You really do only have one eye. Oh, my eye. Give it to me. Give it to me, and I won't kill Marcos for having you steal it! Give it to me! You want it? Get it. You don't stand a chance. Ah! 
I'm not an animal. I shouldn't delay here any further. Even rats like these have friends on Kefalonia. Why, Zeus? These Kefalonian bandits are no joke. Good thing you're on my side. They really seem to fear you. And thank you enough. After spending most of my life at sea, it would have been absolutely shameful to drown in a pot. Ah, where are my manners? I am Varnavas, captain of the Adrestia. Well, Varnavas, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Alexios, Mystios by trade. <laughs> oh, but you're much more than that, I'm sure. What do you mean? When they forced my head underwater, I prayed to the gods. And when they pulled it out, there you were. All of Kefalonia heard your prayers. I just happened to be closest. <laughs> and you just happened to fight like Achilles while Zeus's eagle flies around your head. So you have a ship. Of course. Gods forbid I'd end up stuck in this place. Where is it now? Thanks to you, it's still in Sami Harbor, where I left it. Seeing as I saved your ship and your life, I'd say you owe me. Mind of a Mystios. You know who you remind me of? Me. <laughs> a much younger me, of course, before I found my true purpose and lost my eye. You're changing the subject. Ah, yes. My apologies. You're right. I owe you my life. What could humble Varnavas do for the mighty Alexios? I need a ship and a crew. <laughs> of course you do. So that's a yes. My ship, my crew, and my services are yours. You truly aren't from around here. Ha <laughs> ha! Gods, no! And I thank them for that! Come now and see the Adrestia! I should try to stay out of sight.
We are ready when you are, Captain. Wait! Wait for me, Alexios. I'm all packed and everything. You're coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Phoebe, you're not old enough. I can't look after you all the time. I can look after myself. I don't need anyone to help me. Even if that were true, it's not your time. But there wouldn't be any trouble. Promise. If I can't come, then take Hara. Hara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mother gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know, to remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. Besides, I love Kina to play with, since you saved her. Go easy on her. She may still be shaky with the fever. But you have to promise we'll see each other again. I promise. You haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out of trouble until then. I will. Don't worry. Okay, you can leave now. Alexios! Leaving Kefalonia without saying goodbye to your dear Marcos? Tell me it isn't true. Well, you're here now, so it won't be true. Goodbye, Marcos. All these years as a dynamic duo! I'll never replace you! Well, I may need another assistant someday, but it won't be easy. Come now, give me a hug. <sighs> All right, come here. Yes, bring it in. Oh, will I ever miss you, Alexios? Thanks, Marcos. I'll miss you too. And what does the future hold for you? Wine, of course. Though, you never know when the vines will wither. I'm always ready for another adventure. Speaking of adventure, I have a task for you, dear Phoebe. An adventure? Yes! Already following in your footsteps, isn't she, my friend? Ready to set sail? Prepare to cast off. It's time to leave. Good! The tides wait for neither man nor woman. Time to go. So, what course do we set? Where in this big, beautiful world does the mighty Alexios want to go? Megaris. <laughs> Megaris? But we'll be sailing into war. I got a contract for some general's head. Whose head? They call him the Wolf. The Wolf? Who wants Nikolaos of Sparta dead? Nikolaos of Sparta? <laughs> the Oracle has spoken! <laughs> To prevent Sparta's fall, the child must fall first. You can't let this happen. Please, she'll do no harm. She'll help us. She will lead us. Silence! <sighs> Listen! 
Nicolás! Nicolás! Get me to Megaris. Now. But I don't understand. Of all the places under Ilios, why risk our necks to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father. Nothing like a sea breeze. Does the deck always feel like it's moving? <laughs> I've got the perfect opportunity for you to get your sea legs. Oh? What would that be? Well, when the Cyclops was giving me a drumming, his pirates took my cargo. I know their ship, and I know where they're heading. What say we get it back? Sure. It'll be a good opportunity to see how your ship and crew perform. All right there. Let's get moving. Let's see how the sails have held up. Good to have you back, Commander. Go! Fast as we can! We've spotted some salvage! Shoot! Hey. 
All right, then. Let's get moving. Let's see how the sails are held up. Sapi, 
I lost a couple good men in the scrap with those pirates. The seas are more dangerous now that Sparta and Athens are at each other's throats. We need new recruits to better our crew. I know where to start. The best archer I know. He'd be a valuable asset. When can we meet him? Well, you're going to have to persuade him. What do you mean? You get him aboard and I'll talk him into it. A little Drachmi should sweeten the deal. So you want me to knock him out? No, no. Well, maybe just pacify him a bit. Then get him to the ship so we can have a little talk. Everything will be fine, I promise you. Spot my target. That's my target.
You're strong. Good. Gather your things and meet me at my ship. You'll make a worthy addition to the crew. Definitely something there. Where did that come from? There's nothing here. Got him. Good. He'll be a valuable asset to the crew. Will he be enough? Don't worry. There'll be plenty of opportunities to recruit more people as we go. Something tells me we're going to need them. We should set a course for Megaris. A long voyage can be relaxing, but we are not really the cruising type. If you want to spice things up a bit, you can always check my log over there. I make a note of anything I hear that could be of interest. To a daring captain. 